above and beyond the call of duty to deliver a gift to a stranger in the hospital. <laughs> it's a great story. That gift just happened to be a cake. Here's the rest of the story from our Brenda Matuti. Linda Cannon has been at the Krista Spawn Hospital since Saturday. I have a bad heart. And while resting, she saw a commercial that sent her taste buds into a frenzy. It was a craving. Somebody said something about Cracker Barrel on TV. Bought me some chocolate cake before. And it, I had to have it. Cannon's condition doesn't allow her to leave the hospital, though. So her granddaughter sprung into action. She heard, I told her my mom was craving Cracker Barrel Coca-Cola cake. And she said, do you want to bet me 20 bucks I get her cake there delivered today? And I said, I'm not going to bet you. And the idea for a sweet surprise was in the making. Some say you can't have your cake and eat it too. But the general manager of the local Cracker Barrel says otherwise. Lyndall White received the call from Cannon's granddaughter. Macy was really trying. She she called every third party uh, provider she could think of. And he understood the need to help. Yeah, a big part of it too is uh, I, I could relate. Uh, my grandmother is up in Ohio, and uh, I, you know you're far away, and you can I could feel the uh, the agony of being that, that far away, especially when a loved one's sick. So on Monday, Lindell set out to the Krista Spawn, and in comes the cake. And this really nice fellow came and brought me some cake. I've been eating it for three days. And out comes a smile. I think we broke all the rules, which is I love to break the rules. Cannon says this is a cake. She'll save her to the last bite. I appreciate him so much going out of his way because he didn't have to do that. Brenda Batuti. Oh, he's got to be the fairy godmother. Action 10 News.